Hey G-Squad, welcome back to another episode of Is It Worth It? So for today's episode, we got this cool, amazing product right here in my hand. You guys can see, it's by the brand right here. I believe it's pronounced Sam Bang Ang. Sam Bang Ang. And pretty much what this is, is an airtight cold brew uh, coffee maker that you can use to make cold brew coffee. Um, but you guys also use this to make hot tea or hot coffee you guys want to. I believe it was like 100 Celsius to 200 Celsius. As long as you guys don't pass that limit, then you guys should be fine. But first thing first, let's open up and show you guys what comes out the package itself first. So first thing we see right here is the user manual instruction guide right here, if you guys can see. And then here is the actual product itself right here. So the overall product itself looks and feels really nice. It's actual real glass and it's airtight and it's actually uh, insulated and everything which is pretty awesome. They have a measurement on here if you guys can see. According to the measurement here, I believe the highest is 1000 milliliter if you guys can see. So there's 1000 right there, uh, 600 right there and 400 right there. It has a really nice kind of handle that's glass that's really durable as well which is pretty cool. Top part right here you can see that's vacuum sealed so we, all you have to do is kind of turn it. And, or just open it up like this and it basically once you guys open the product itself you guys can hear there's like a vacuum that uh, insulate the product really really well so that way you guys know that the product itself is vacuum and also uh, insulated really well and if we open this component right here you guys can see that this is basically what it looks like right here so they have a filter right here which is stainless steel and on top of that it's actually a double layer uh, stainless steel filter so that way you guys won't have to worry about any coffee or whatever that comes out of the filter itself um, it's actually double layered if you guys can see inside not sure if you can see or not it's hard to show you guys in the video but it is double layered uh, stainless steel filter which is pretty nice so you guys can actually use this to make coffee or tea depending on what you guys want to do i'm mostly going to be using this for tea i feel like uh, more than like coffee since i'm not too big of a coffee drinker anymore I, i'm actually drinking a lot more tea so i'll probably do a test using the tea to show you guys uh, how well it works and everything but the main thing that people want to use this product for is obviously to make coffee, uh, cold brew coffee. So basically how it works is that you guys want to put in your hot water or whatever in here first. And then you can put this part back in here like this. However much you guys want to drink, pour it in here. And once you guys are done, just seal back up the product right here. Make sure you put it on correctly all the way. And then once you guys are finished with that, just put it in the refrigerator up to 12 hours. And then the next morning, you guys will have cold brew coffee all ready for you guys. That is if you guys want to drink cold brew coffee. If you guys want to drink hot coffee or hot tea, then you guys can actually just do it on the day of and uh, whatever. You guys can just bring it to work or whatever. Or even if you guys want to, you guys don't even need to bring it to work. You guys can just leave it at your office and just drink this uh, all day and whatever. Definitely one thing that I actually really like about the product when I first saw this is the fact that it has a wide mouth. And that, so that means it's actually much easier to clean compared to like the smaller mouth uh, insulated bottles or whatever. Second thing that's actually pretty awesome is the fact that it's airtight uh, vacuum. So that way it will actually keep the product itself uh, fresh. And if you guys leave it in the fridge or whatever, there won't be any chemicals or bacteria that will go inside because of the vacuum technology on here. And if you guys look at the cap part right here, you can see that this little tip right here, so I, you guys can actually pour out the coffee after opening up this uh, cap right here, so that's pretty cool. So that's basically everything that's on the product itself. Let me actually go do a quick test to make some hot tea to show you guys uh, when actually it works and how well it works, and then see when I, I can actually uh, support uh, using hot water into the product itself. Because usually since it's all glass, it usually does not support it in my crack. But let's see how it works. Alright, so here we have the product right here. We're going to test it out using some tea instead of some cold brew coffee. We're going to see when it actually works. So I'm going to put some tea in here first. Just put a couple in there. If you guys want to put more, you guys can. But as you can see, I just put a couple inside for now. Just to try it out and see how it works. So uh, basically, next thing you guys want to do is add some water in here. So I have some water all boiled here. And see whether or not the glass can actually hold up the heat of the uh, hot water or not. Alright, so we add in the water in here. You guys can see that the tea does work. So the glass itself is actually really hot. So you guys don't want to touch the glass uh, when you guys are using the product. Uh, you guys want to hold it by the handle. But you can see that it actually holds up the heat pretty well. Let's add some more water and see how well it uh, holds and everything. So it's kind of hard for me to show you guys how the water is drained into the tea and everything but you can see that it does work and sure it's quite well but if you guys hold the hand you guys won't feel the hotness of the product itself i'm pretty impressed how you can hold the hot temperature uh so well if you can see nothing's wrong with the product and you guys want to keep it more warm you can put this cap right here which is vacuum sealed just like that and then it's all set to uh, drink the water or tea later on whenever it's all done so that's basically everything that's on the product 
you guys can see that I actually holds up the heat pretty well and just nothing wrong with the product so far. Probably have to use it over time a little bit more and then see uh, how the performance is over time. Hey, welcome back guys. So now you guys saw the test the product, you can see that actually does work and it works really well. Uh, I didn't make any cold brew coffee, but I did make the tea like I said. So the tea in general actually works really well. Cleaning the product is actually really easy as well. You just have to open everything up, like the, all the heads right here, remove it, uh, start rinsing the product. If you guys need to use a sponge to fit your hand inside, you guys can because of the white mouth like I said earlier. So that's pretty awesome. I really love the fact that the double stainless steel filters, that way none of the coffee or the tea leaves or whatever can come out. So that way you guys can actually get a really, really good uh, filter drink, which is pretty awesome. So now that we did the unboxing and test testing our product itself, now to ask the question of whether or not it's actually worth it or not. So for me honestly, I have to say that this is actually really really worth it if you guys uh, drink coffee or tea, if you guys need to filter out any tea or coffee, then this is actually really worth it. <laughs> Especially of the material and everything on here like double uh, stainless steel filter the whole glass product itself to actually withstand Cold and hot drinks the vacuum sealed uh, cap itself So that way nothing will leak out the product and also keeps your product really fresh Even if you guys leave it in the uh, refrigerator for a long period of time and also it actually will save you guys a lot of money So you guys don't have to keep buying a cold brew coffee in like the uh, Coffee shop or whatever if you guys want to make your own But then obviously for those guys who don't want one or don't need one or have no use for one of these they obviously don't buy one and save your money for something else they actually do need but other than that that's much it for a little unboxing testing and feedback about this product hope you guys enjoyed this video if you guys did then make sure to subscribe like and comment down below and if you guys like this video and you guys want to see more then make sure to click on that bell notification in the bottom to be notified of new videos that will be coming up in the future but as always make sure to stay positive be you and i'll see you guys in the next episode of is it worth it peace and then for today's g squad fan shout out day we have